wedding day of Springbok strongman Gersro Steenkamp wasn't memorable only for him and his bride, Jana Kiet. For rugby fans, this, my friends, was the real royal wedding. Cool as you like at Loftus, here the linchpin of the box scrum was far more unsettled. If we were to believe Gerthrow's cousin and best man, Zeke Morgan. Zeke, you're one person who genuinely knows how Gather is keeping up. How's he feeling? So look, for the last hour he's been putting on a brave face, but I know, knowing him for years, that uh, there's a lot of nerves out there. And he probably feels like he's making his debut for South Africa at the moment. It must be amazing to have seen him grow up from a young boy to 2010 player of the year, and now the guy's getting married. Look, definitely uh, he's calmed down quite a bit, um, which would have been less set in. And I think the whole thing since he's got to engage has just calmed him down and uh, getting him ready for marriage. I didn't realize that rugby players cleaned up so well. You're looking pretty <laughs> slick. Oh, thank you. Nothing but a good show in the show can do, eh? I see you've learned a thing or two from France. You've gone with the whole cravat and waistcoat look. You look pretty sharp. Oh, well, when living in France, you have to. Je habite en France. Mm, je parle un petit français. Oh, je parle bien français. <laughs> Any jitters? How are you feeling? I don't think the jitters have kicked him, but um, he's very excited. It's, uh, it's probably been one of the biggest days ever in my life, and I'll be honest with you, nothing comes close to this day, this form of excitement, this form of joy. It's, it's amazing. It's, I've never had this feeling before. Well, you look really calm. Yeah, I think maybe it's the calm before the storm, so <laughs> we'll see how the rest of the day goes. Still a long way to go. His fiancée, Jana Kiert, did what the All Blacks can only dream of. On their very first meeting, she managed to stop Gerthrow dead in his tracks. How is your future hubby going to deal with all this hotness that is going on here? You look like you've just stepped out of a dream. Um, I have no idea. He hasn't seen me yet, so I hope he doesn't run away at first. <laughs> Are you nervous, Jana? So nervous. <laughs> I can't explain it. This is the day that you've been dreaming about since you were a little girl. Yes, no, it is. Definitely. Butterflies the whole day. I think it's worse than a test match. <laughs> At the age of 30, Gerthrow is already a Curry Cup, Super 14 and World Cup title winner. Looking up at him in her sparkling Duchess satin gown is the woman who's given up her job to join him in France and make the travelling life of a rugby professional a complete family affair. Their union gets a ringing endorsement from fellow Bok, CJ van der Linde. Very nice occasion to see one of my uh, big friends uh, getting married. Known him since school days, uh, played rugby against him and seeing him grow up uh, through Bastia at the Free State, uh, playing together for Free State and then he moved off to the Bulls. So yeah, obviously very nice to see him getting married to the love of his life. No, it's fantastic. It's such a nice venue and uh, everything's been organised well. Can't wait for the party. Uh, Gatro is always the uh, leading guy with the party, so I think it's going to be a great evening. Yeah, I must say, it's a side I thought I'd never see, but uh, in all fairness, I must say I'm very happy for Gatti that he's found someone that he truly loves. And uh, I think Joanna's a great girl, and I, I wish him all the best for, for the future. Before leaving for France, Jana drew a picture of her theme. And with just a few Skype calls to follow up, her genius coordinator, Juanita Birkus, managed to create a world from that picture. The bride didn't change a thing. And here at Sorex Estate, Hester Peters carried out the game plan to perfection. I think we had physically the hardest task, um, and the team worked really hard to bring all the detail and the small magic to make the whole romantic castle feel come alive. And what a castle theme without a silver goblet. Yes, I, I think that does make um, an extra special statement. Together with the red glass and the champagne glass, I think it's a nice combination that they went with. And I love the flower arrangements, especially the one with just the water with the little flower. Simple, but striking. That was a special way of incorporating Jana's um, favourite flower, which is a black Zantadisha. As you'll see, we used it mainly at the main table, because it is for Jana. It's clear that Jana's favourite colour is red. We had to be careful because we didn't want to go for a Christmas look with white and red. But certainly right on the mark for Valentine's Day. From his blue and white cape upbringing, to playing in the orange of the Free State, the blue of the Bulls, and then the green and gold, there were many colourful tales for the speeches. Some from Gertrude's dad, Julian, an avid soccer player who bred a rugby player. Every parent wants to see their child succeed. You must be a very proud father today. Yeah, I think so. 
But me as a father would like to tell him and Jana to have the best luck, best wishes for them. And if they believe in themselves and they believe in God, surely they'll make a success of their life. It's been awesome seeing them to get together and just the love today has been extraordinary. They're heading for the dynamic rugby mad city of Toulouse, leaving a bouquet and garter and taking Yana's children with them to soak up the sea of culture that's all around them in the heart of France. For a very brief honeymoon stretch at least, Mrs. Steenkamp gets to boast an unblemished husband. Yana, you were most worried about Gothra coming in one piece. Didn't he look absolutely dashing? Stunning. <laughs> Had no bruises, no stitches, nothing. So thank goodness for that. Which moment stood out for you tonight? Oh, definitely uh, my heart stood still when she walked through those doors. It was really amazing. I was boiling with emotions. I had to contain myself. I think if it had to be just for another minute longer, it would definitely have been in tears. <laughs> Having overcome serious injury, Gerthrow now enters the prime of a prop forward's career. And with his new family, the only way is up. Like they said in their vows, their love will burn like an eternal flame. And what better way to symbolize this with a thousand lanterns in the sky? Gertrude and Yana, from us here at Tubbling, we wish you all the best.